early tomorrow morning. Okay, your date of birth, please. Non-stop ringing phones and questions to answer. Okay. Am I registered? Where am I registered? Where is my polling place? With the stakes so high, a record turnout is predicted Tuesday. In fact, here in Nassau, the Board of Elections has registered nearly 70,000 new voters in the last year, many of them black and Latino. Carlos Figueroa will cast a ballot in his second election. It's a good idea for us to get out there and, and try to make sure that the guy that we want is in is in. And as News 12 Long Island reported, federal monitors, civil rights groups, and lawyers will be at the polls in Nassau and Suffolk to make sure the minority residents are not intimidated from exercising their right to vote. Very often some Latinos may have uh, a, a Spanish accent, English may be their second language, and they're asked for proof of citizenship, a work authorization, a birth certificate, uh, which is unethical and illegal. County lawmaker Kevon Abrahams will be hitting many of the 40 polling precincts in his district to ensure those who are entitled to vote get to vote. They go into there feeling confident that their vote's going to matter and their vote will be counted. I think we expect positive results definitely for our elect electoral process. Just hours before the polls open on Long Island, it's a presidential contest too close to call. But political analyst Jerry Kremer offers this election eve opinion. If it's a big turnout, it probably is not going to be bad for President Bush. If there's an overwhelming turnout, something that no one ever anticipated, then I think the president's people have to be quite nervous. So, oh, how important is tomorrow's election? Add to Nassau's 70,000 new registrants, another 48,000 in Suffolk. And for those who can't make it to the polls, nearly 50,000 Long Islanders have already sent in their absentee ballots. And that leads us to our question of the day. Are you going to vote? Log on to our website, news12.com, to register your answer. And be sure to join us right here tomorrow night.